a major development in our efforts to obtain the body camera and dash cam video of Mayor Tom Henry's drunk driving arrest. Good evening, I'm Kelsey Mannix. Thank you for joining us tonight. First reported by Fox 55 this afternoon, Indiana's public access counselor says the city of Fort Wayne violated the Access to Public Records Act by not releasing it. We, along with other local news outlets, have been working to get the video since Henry's arrest in October. And City Council President Jason Arp has also been vocal about the frustrations with this issue. Fox 55's Brianna Bias spoke to him tonight. She's live now at the Allen County Courthouse with that response and more details about what that public access counselor said. Brianna. Good evening, Kelsey. Yes, Mayor Henry first pleaded guilty to drunk driving back on October 10th, and Fox 55 requested the body camera footage from his arrest the very next day. But the city attorney told us we couldn't have it because it was investigatory record. But in the public access counselor's opinion that was published today, Lucas Britt says Henry pleaded guilty, so that means the footage is no longer investigatory record. So they're violating public access laws by not releasing it. Fox 55 sent in a second request for the footage on November 4th after Henry's sentencing. They told us they received the request, but we have not heard anything from the city attorney since. And we are not only the ones, we are not the only ones who are asking for the video to be released. City Councilman Jason Arp is also trying to get it released and says this recommendation from, Bit, from Britt could help. Um, there's been questions about some of the circumstances that, that happened on the scene that um, we have no clarity as to um, whether or not those allegations are true or not. This will give us the opportunity to take a look to see if they were or not. I also reached out to John Perlick with the city of Fort Wayne to see if they had read the document and how they will respond to it. He said they're still reviewing the opinion and will have a, res a formal response later on. And ARP says despite how long this process is taking, he does believe the process is as it should be. And he believes Britt's opinion that was published today will apply the necessary pressure to get it done. All right, Brianna, so does this mean the document will force the city to release the footage? I think that's the big question here. Sure. The short answer, no. Technically, they still can deny our request. And that's an important point. But Britt says that if they do deny that request, they are going to open themselves up to a slew of lawsuits. And of course, Fox 55 will continue to investigate this situation and update you both on air and online at WFFT.com. Live from the Allen County Courthouse, I'm Brianna Bias, Fox 55 News.